Hey, hey, what is up, Credit Movement community? It's Ryan, and this is Daily Credit Minute, episode 115. So in this episode, I want to talk about, I got the girls in the car, they got their Packers outfits on. <clears throat> We're happy to have Aaron Rodgers back. But I want to talk about, so many people say, Ryan, I had something removed from my credit, but it popped back on. I don't know what to do. What can I do to get it removed permanently? Well, there's a law out there that it, it's within Fair Credit Reporting Act, Section 611. And there's a letter that I'm going to share in the comments that's directly from page 43 of the book that we just released. And um, the letter is called the five-day reinsertion letter. Um, the law says that they have to notify you within five days. Hey, girls. <laughs> within five days if they put something back on your credit. So, um most of the time they do not notify you, so you have a legal right to challenge that to make sure it's permanently deleted at a credit bureau level. So use this letter, <clears throat> insert your information into it, send it to the credit bureaus. They have 30 days by law to do their, their legal research and then get back to you. So hopefully this letter will work to permanently remove it. It's in the comments. Again, this comes directly from our book from page 43. Um, if you're interested in the book, um, you can go to thecreditmovement.com and just click the get the book link and it's available there. Um, many people are spending hundreds or thousands of dollars on credit repair companies. This book will show you exactly what to do. Um, it's a lot more in depth and, um, and customized to your situation than most credit repair companies are giving you anyway. So I hope this helps you guys out. I really appreciate the support. Share our posts, um, like our page to make sure you're notified of other tips and tricks like this. And as always guys, keep coming back for more.